to the timber again now then and a mares only two mile five furlong turtle uh, a top shinon novelle for alex cherry's also got race capello movie lights david hooley indian queens darren thompson starry elfo Derek Hinton, Apache Drums and Mabel Pines, or Leon Van Rensburg, Rapunzel and Seven Bridges Road, Martin Lidham, Bonash and Orange Cassidy for Matt Cooper, and Natural Beauty and Zephonics Gem for Graham Clutterbuck. So 13 again then. Away they go. And Mabel Pines and Study Elf for the first through the show, and their Indian Queens is also coming through as they sort themselves out. Pace doesn't appear to be that hot as they take the first of the 16 hurdles. Hurdles look, that look like mini versions of the Grand National Fences, don't they? Well, it's Indian Queens in the lead in there by about two lengths as they take the second of the 16, which they're all safely over. But there's only two more flights to take in this one than in the two more one foot on race earlier on. So Indian Queens in, in the lead for Darren Thompson. Started off well with the four year old hurdler, but this chaser fell in the last race, so we'll be hoping to do a little bit better this time. And Indian Queens has got an undisputed lead of about four lengths or so. The rest of them are in a bit of a clump at this stage. Seven Bridges Road in the maroon colours is the one widest on the track, giving away quite a lot of ground as they come down to the third, which they skip over. As we said in the last race, you can see this is a figure of eight track, so. I've got them going the wrong way in one of the earlier races. I thought they were going to take a turn when they didn't. I think you'll see that grandstand will sometimes appear to be on the left and sometimes it'll appear to be on the right, depending on which part of the track they're on. Now, Indian Queens is in the lead. I'm reliably informed this track is has been made for inclusion with SO8. So, no news yet as to when we'll able to see that. I'll be guessing it'll be sometime in 2024 and well, this track isn't going to feature in the upcoming league season so a bit of a one-off special so if you get yourself a course specialist on well, this track it's not going to do a lot of good in the league unfortunately but it's indian queens is in the lead from a rapunzel in second and then apache drums is third borash after that one in fourth if they get over the seventh safely over that one. With Indian Queens clear in front, I would say. Probably Fontwell's the closest course in the game to this one. But it's Indian Queens in front. From Rapunzel in second, Movie Lights is third, Zephonics Gem is next as they get over number eight. Which then all safely over seven Bridges Road continuing to be the back marker. As they get over the ninth. I wonder how many other people like me got something lined up for this race and then realised that it was a gelding or a colt. I realised that they had to swap it to something else. Anyway, it's Indian Queens in front. I'm always checking the small print. And Movie Lights is in second. And Apache Drums is third. Starry Nelfel is after that one. And then Orange Cassidy, Shinon Novale is next. But Indian Queens has been in the lead pretty much all the way. There's just a mile left to go now. Movie Lights is second, starring Elfel is in third, then comes Seven Bridges Road, who's made a forward move for the back, Rapunzel after that, and that was a three mile hurdle winner in the league last season, then Apache Drums, Orange Cassidy's next, as they get over the 10th, and Indian Queens is leading by a battle length and a half to Starring Elfel in second, Apache Drums moves smoothly through into third place, Orange Cassidy is also getting a bit closer, then comes Natural Beauty as they get over the 12th, there's four more to go then now, and Indian Queen's being pushed along in the lead from Starring Elfel in second, Apache Drums is in third, then Natural Beauty, Movie Lights and Orange Cassidy, Seven Bridges Road under pressure, and on the inside Rapunzel and towards the back race, Capello is the one who's out of shot and seemingly out of it, but it's Indian Queen's in front from Star. Starring Elfel in second, Apache Drums is third, and Natural Beauty is four. Then Movie Lights and Zephonics, Gem get into it, then Orange Cassidy. Difficult to see anything else, because although Rapunzel will stay on on the inside, but it's Indian Queens in front. Indian Queens then swinging towards home with three to take. Indian Queens in the lead from Starry and Elfel. Movie Lights, Apache Drums, Natural Beauty over to third, last they go. And it's still Indian Queens who's been in the lead all the way. From Movie Lights in second, Natural Beauty is next. Then Starry and Elfel, Apache Drums, Rapunzel trying to run on. 
So two Mabel Pines, they're coming down towards the final two flights, and now Indian Queens is under strong driving. Indian Queens in the lead over the second last jumps it nicely. Better jump on the outside though by Apache Drums, who's coming through the challenge. Natural beauty between the two of them. Then comes Movie Light, Seven Bridges Road, and Rapunzel are running on. They come down to the final flight. Over it they go, and Apache Drums landed in the lead. Apache Drums in front. Indian Queens is trying to fight back, but Apache Drums takes it. Indian Queens is saying. Movie Lights and Noble Pines, then Natural Beauty, Seven Bridges Road was after that. Shimon Novelay finished well. And Race at Pillow was the last to finish. And Leon van Rinsburg back in the trials takes another one with Apache Drums. Indian Queens second and Movie Lights third. It's going to fall this to Patchy Drums, Leon Van Rensburg, the winner. Indian Queens, long time leader, Darren Thompson, second. Movie Lights, David Hooley, third. Mabel Pines was fourth for Leon Van Rensburg. And fifth was Natural Beauty for Graham Clutterbuck.